Hey, Birdsall here. Now, as you may or may not know, we're under renovation, right? So we're getting, as you can see here, you know, baseboards are missing, they're painting everything. Well, earlier, they tore out the front up here. So all that desk and everything where you guys used to go pick up your prizes, that's taken out because they're redoing the whole floor. So we get temporary uh, cubicles and stuff up here. And uh, the DME, Bridget, the one that you always see in the videos with me and the makeovers and everything, She's our digital managing editor. And hers was over this way. So, what you don't know is earlier today, Bridget was telling Sean Holbert, he's the RIT guy in that office, that, he, that she wanted it to take all of the desk parts and make a fort around her cubicle. And she tried, she did a little bit of it. But, I mean, I can move all of it. So let me go ahead and introduce you to Town Square Cribs, the Fort Demis edition. First off, we come in with this very nice stately column that'll stop most, most visitors from coming in. And then you'll see branding. That's important. Uh, also, you'll see that uh, she has a couple of peepholes here so she can look out. Dandy sign right here. Beware all ye who dare breach thy walls of Fort Demis. All right, anyway. Uh, so here's uh, the rest of all of it. I didn't use any glue or anything. I just, or nails or screws. I just kind of grabbed a couple of clipboards and everything's held together by a couple of springs and out of my mind. That was your sign you had out here earlier, Bridget. Also, uh, the first design of this, I didn't have a door. I assumed Sean was going to be in earlier. I called him just in case. Turns out he wasn't going to be in as early as you. So I built you a door. Ta-da! Right? If you're thirsty, you have your own cup right here that you could send one of the lowly salespeople to go fill. 2015 edition of the boot from Toyota Country Lights Festival. Let's take a look inside of Fort Demise. Well, all right, as you can see, it's adequately shaded. Uh, this didn't fit very well, so you have a little air here, but I'm guessing that this overhead cover that I put in should should deflect any paper clips that have been tossed over the fort uh, perimeter uh, by Heather, the front desk woman. Uh, you'll see here that everything has full supports, spring-loaded supports, so nothing will fall in upon your head while you're working. You have this very nice conduit here that you could pull out and whip people with if they get too close to the door. Uh, also, you can strangle them with it if need be. And if you're able somehow to electrify this cut end, you'll also be able to wrestle them into submission and then stick their face on that open wire, right? Look, I was thinking, you have got all of the bells and whistles in here. You know what I'm saying? And the privacy and solitude that every fort owner loves. Yeah, I'm doing what I can to make you feel like you're at home and make the sinister in you come out. So uh, yeah, here's your portholes, right? See, here, I'll give you the view. So here's Bridget's view. What do you want? And you, what do you want? All right, I'll stop. But anyway, hope you enjoy your little fort here, Bridge. This has been a Town Square Media Cribs.